Snake wasn't that puzzle. Big shout out to my nigga SPI, Spotter Low. You know, I'm in the black box. Had to come through, tap in, show love one time. Yeah, y'all make sure y'all subscribe. Stay tuned. Hmm. What y'all think? You think somebody did something to cut? I mean, you think somebody did? You know how I said cut? While I was talking, I was reading Mix 60 Joe uh, uh, post. He talking about every act of low rapping, rapping should automatically should tap in with you, SBI, because the locs are confusing me, SBI. Oh, uh, man, I'm going to tell you. One thing is what I want you to do, and this will help you out. I had to learn this lesson the hard way. When the streets and the industry separate them. Separate the two. There is a difference. I don't care if you're a loke, whatever you call yourself. It seems like this industry does something to uh, individuals. You know, I keep it a Google percent cripping as far as encountering um, anybody in this industry. And it's the simple math, like how you say on that loke, when you're moving around, and it's rips, a whole lot of shit should be automatic. I understand where you're coming from, but I learned that ain't how it go. Yeah. Just think, I had a, a whole issue. Just think, uh, I jumped out on some goofball, right? Um, this is Snoop Dogg Mama, alongside Suge Knight. That's the corniest thing I did industry-wise. And I'm willing to admit that I was young. Come on, you see what I'm doing? That's my son, y'all. That's crazy. You see we getting it in. They stay up all night playing video games to 6, 7 in the morning until you tell them that. <laughs> oh, blah, 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 blah. But anyway, yeah, he wake up talking to the sleep. But uh, I did that old sh right? As a man, once I got down with the New York cats, right, I'm like, damn. At a at a West Coast Peace Conference where they invited every West Coast rapper beside me, I had no idea it was I was already signed, had a deal. Nobody, everybody thought to call me. Right, my homie from my hood, solo from Love May, hit me and said, "You ain't going to the Swooty Wop Wop." I'm like, "What?" He like, "Man, all them rap niggas is up at the Universal." Uh, Sheraton or wherever the, the hotel was right now, they having like a boot. I'm like, yeah. And whatever uh, time it was, saying it was like 1 p.m. when he called me. It, the thing started at 12. So it's just me, Crash, and like I think Puto, or maybe just me and Crash. We was two or three deep. We shoot up there, right? Yeah. So the little video footage y'all see, that's from that moment when we get up in there. Now, I'm under the understanding this is a West Coast Peace Conference, right? So, I make it my business to approach Snoop Dogg on some G shit and, you know, let him know I know that wasn't kosher, cool, or cripping for me to uh, disrespect him and even more so his mother on, um, on that record, right? Cud looked me in my eye, told me he overstand. You know, the environment I was in, he'd been there and all that, and just told me, just keep it cripping, cuz. And from then, I thought we was A1, right? But I got video post that day where somebody got to ask him about me in an interview, and he like, fuck that nigga, cuz. That game, my homeboy. Whoopty, whoopty, whoop. And he tripping on game. He, I do this and all that. G Unit can't say you, cuz. He said, yeah, cuz I remember. Spotted Look was at my peace conference <laughs> trying to like clown me for being humble enough to approach him with the peace, right? So, yeah, hell yeah. From day one, I figured, you know, you keep it cripping in the industry. That's what Cuz told me, Cuz. When I came as a man, he said, keep it cripping. Which I figured, you know, when you with some crips, that's, I've been doing that. Every platform, everywhere I go, from the streets to the penitentiary, to the county jail, to everywhere I go, go out of town. If you're on the streets, same thing. It's a certain thing with the Crips. But, 
you get to that industry, you know what Crips in the industry kept it cripping off top? That was like niggas that had names on our metal. Snoop kept it cripping to a degree, but what fee knocked me up was this. On that video when he trying to clown me for apologizing, cuz say, which I don't remember him saying, but he say he told me, oh, I already got love for you cuz I did a record with you, which he had done for your boss 50 Cent, cuz like, since 50 Cent love you, I love you. Not cuz we East Side Crippin' or West Coast and none of that. He say he love me cuz the New York nigga love me. But I don't know, this in the industry, she play out different, you know. That's really how I became comfortable being so disrespectful towards Snoop in the long run. Because if you look at the dynamic, it's not, I, I attended to extend olive branches multiple times. Oh, um, my mama, my, 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 a lot of them I don't even know if to reach. I sent them through E-40, my big homie T.Y. It seemed like I uh, wasn't ever trying to hear that. So, you know, the last time he spoke on it was cuss clowning me for apologizing. How long do you continue to apologize and kiss a nigga ass who clowned you for it beginning? Oh, um, my mama, mama. So when, it, when you go from there, just think. I... Y'all know the history. I came to that West Coast conference to apologize, squash it. We left solid. Cuz tripped on me for tripping on Doja. And then him and 50 never skipped the beat. But nine times out of ten, one of the most motivating reasons for Curtisha to lose interest. This is how the rap game go. It's different, cuz. You can't just think, oh, Crips. Shh. Same platform, same arena, same. Keep it cripping, you good. That has always worked amongst the Crips for me all my life. But in the industry, oh my mama, mama, it just be different. Like, oh no, baby, it's cause uh, they talk that talk, and I walk that walk. Spider was the name that they gave me Once they seen a nigga went gangbang crazy Bad idea for me to gangbang maybe But I done flipped the script and made the same thing Pay me from the principal office It was lost Petrinos Hit the county jail young then it was off the Chino Blade from the Buffalino off in the bottle Deputies found that They shot a nigga off to the module And that's an environment it's hard to explain But you best to love the gangbang hard in your veins Cause niggas will throw mind games hard at your brain Trying to see if your manhood is all that you claim He's the homies but it's all in the game And I done seen a mini nigga fall to their shame I stay ten toes down I can't lie, I had to stop it on my mama Mama, you just fucked me up Cuz said, much love though But it's still crazy He said, what's cracking from Wizzo Crack? NYC, that's New York City, y'all Santana Block, Compton Crip What you know about that? <laughs> Salute with it. So my mama, mama, no, like, that's crazy, God. I'm walking that walk. That's why I'm on this microphone talking that talk. Why the low was the name that they gave me? Dear God, the boy going. Oh, yeah, I stopped the list of the rappers that kept it cripping. Got distracted. Sebo, J.O. Felony. Uh, who else? Uh... That was like already in the gee name. And then when I came along, uh, Big Psych, rest in peace. Uh, I might be forgetting a few on my mama mama, but that's the core of it, uh, less or more on my mama mama. Only do I talk that talk, ask the homies. A nigga really walk that walk. Why the local the name that they gave me? Dear God, the boy going crazy. Not only do I talk that talk, ask the homies. A nigga really walk that walk. I did murders, I ain't say nothing about. Fuck writing on the wall, I'm trying to lay something out. Can't help to put in work, I got all these guns. After dumping, the only time you ever saw me run. You ain't going on no missions, you ain't finna be hanging. You all about your slanging while the enemy's banging. Fuck that. 
too many homies resting in peace. It's not seldom. We represent the best in the East. And I could give a fuck about the weak or the soft. You being from the city, but you can get caught it off. And that's on Lil Box, Merc, and Soul. I go hard on the yard like it's first and gold. From day one, a nigga always been the first to roll. Niggas know the turf get worse when I first parole. Cause I'm that lunatic that make the lil homies run. I'm known to hit a lick and buy the lil homies gun. Hey, man, man. the low was the name that they gave me. Cuz said, don't hurt my feelings and say Trey D and Dub C ain't keep it crippin'. Neighborhood to the neighborhood. Shout out Dub C. That's my low cuz. Keep it a Google with you. Some of my very, very first um, mainstream or just hip hop real encounter exposure interest was shown by Dub C. I'll probably tell y'all that story one day. I ain't gonna stretch it out, but neighborhood to Dub C on Crip on oh, my mama mama. And then Trey D, Cub was a Crip, cuz like a nigga used to see Trey D all through the city. Even going to the main street spot buying weed and catch Cub sleep in the corner where I slap him on the thigh. He wake up, look at me, oh spider. After I had this cuz and I seen cuz in the bells bombing, like Trey D used to be out here. I remember he had like a uh a green Lincoln. I seen Cub by Centennial one day. No tent. Rolling by itself. Trey D used to be out here. Like, Trey D was a crip. He was a loke. I ain't gonna take that from Cubs on my mama mama. But I was saying as far as. And you know what? When I met Trey D, Cub, Cub did, yep, at Wino House, Cub. I remember Cub came in with an ounce of weed. Had me rolling the weed while he, he wrote his verse and then wrapped it for the homie, Cub. At that time, that was big to me, Cub. I'm going to just leave it like that. He side crip on my mama, mama, though. Not only do I talk that talk, ask the homies, a nigga really walk that walk. Mm. I never been in a coma, but I done left my enemy laying dead on a corner. It's gonna take a miracle, they say, for a nigga like me to see his 30th birthday. I broke in a house to get my first K. A hundred rounds, put it down in the worst way. G Rod jumped out on feet, make a nigga worst dreams turn to reality. I bought two Mac teens and a 44 mag, a hard top glass house and a six Triz A rag. I ain't never been fronted no keys. Had my own half a bird, and I was fronting no Z's. To the little homies, only like fuck the OGs. Them niggas washed up, we the LOCs. <laughs> Not only do I talk that talk, ask the homies, a nigga really walk that walk. Oh, my mama, mama, uh, we got a caller on the line. Yeah, James Hudson, I know from 190. Really, my first rap deal came from Wino from 190, cuz that's the homie, cuz my big homie Bump took me to go meet cuz, did my stuff. Cuz had what he called low class, he had uh, hard time records at the time, and he had a group called the Lower Class. It was Blue Da Vinci. Da Vinci wasn't on his name though, he was just Blue. It was Blue and Spade. The two, they was two homies from one I know. That was a group that Wino had. And then when I came around, it was basically we were the three artists on the label. But when Wino finally got action from J Corps, which was a major distributor at the time, to do a deal in order to launch his label in the correct fashion, he wanted the most established artist that he could find to do a first project on and that he had a relationship with that fit in his budget. So Cam with the K, West Coast Cam from Watts, was the first up off the uh, the, uh, the label, and they did the Camnesia project. But I remember on my mama, mom, Wino gave me like five bands, no contract. And um, the homie uh, Big Sight, daddy, rest in peace from one I know, his daddy used to have a jewelry store uh, downtown L.A. And um, Wino went down there and had a hard time, records mold made. Out of my five bands, I went and gave the homie, uh, Daddy Rest in Peace, 2200. And uh, that was my first my first pendant. Right then I had the death row change and I had my SPI chain. But yeah, 
Well, that's one though. That's him. Snake Blood Net Puzzle. Big shout out to my nigga SPI, Spotter Low. You know, I'm in the black box. Had to come through, tap in, show love one time. Yeah, y'all make sure y'all subscribe. Stay tuned. All right. Spotter Low, wake and bake. Better keep it Google, nigga. Nate Blood, C Mac. Shout out my low, Spotter Low, cuh. Nate Blood, on the hood. It's a beautiful world. You fight me? Fight, fight, Black Fox Production. Black Fox Production. Black Fox Production.